Okay, here's the finale. The battle of Wuzhong Plains. We have finally come this far. Yes, though it was for the benefit of the land, I have involved far, far too many innocent people. But it was solely for this very moment. Oh, my beloved people, lend me your strength. All right. Here's the intro. After setting out on its northern campaign, Shu drives back the Wei army at Jiating, getting a foothold in the lands of Hanzong. For Shu to destroy Ya Castle of the giant northern country of Wei was a victory with meaning. With the Wu kingdom destroyed, Shu turns its attention back to the restoration of the Han dynasty and sets out to conquer Wei. Meanwhile, Wei's Sima Yi is given a large army and sent west in an effort to meet this challenge. In the year 234, Zhu Gailian, leading his forces into Hanzong, positions them on the Wuzang Plain and prepares for the final battle. Wei and Shu, Zhu Gailian and Sima Yi, these two forces are about to meet in the struggle for supremacy. All right, the equipment's the same, the weapon's the same. It's amazing that I'm going to be using this weapon for all seven Musa, mo uh, not seven Musa mode, seven parts. Uh, the items are going to leave them the way they are. Bodyguards still have four. The conditions are the same. If Sao Sao is defeated, we win. If Liu Bei is defeated, or if I die, we lose. It's a game over. Plain and simple. Unit info. Well. I said before, what you see is what you get from here on out, but I do not recall even playing this battle since we completed, I don't even remember, because I don't think I pointed out Zhao Yuan, uh, he, he replaces Xu Xu in this battle, I did say that after his Musa mode, as well as Pong Tang replacing Wei Yan from here on out. I think this is probably, if Xu Xu's Musa mode is, uh, if it has this battle in it, then yeah, we will be playing this one more time. Yeah, playing this one more time. Anyway, we did the intro, so let's do it. Now we shall decide Wei's fate. All units, faint towards the enemy and head for their base camp. Alright, so the first thing we're going to do really is go up here and defeat Sal Ren. Thank <laughs> you. 
Alright, now we defeated Sal Ren. We're gonna go down to the left and defeat Dian Wei and Shu Huang. Alright, so Shu Huang's next. I think I mentioned in this particular battle that uh there's two items you could obtain, but they're really hard to get. Here's the end way. I will crush you with my own hands. Show them our strength. You are a powerful warrior. That was easy. I meant the combo, not hit, killing him in general. The last part, you see me being a little off in the combo department. But now I managed to pull a 28 combo, which gives me... When it comes to DM Way, uh, plus, uh, a plus 8 shield. Well, you need 24, not 28. And wherever those guys are, well, let's get rid of them. And I lost all my bodyguards again. That's the part that pisses me right off sometimes. Not the crossbows. But for the fact that I get upgrades of bodyguards who is lacking defense. I know all my bodyguards are going to die. I should just set them to zero in that case. Alright, so we completed, well, we defeated Dian Wei and Shu Huang. So now we're going to go up and defeat Cao Hong and Zha Hu Yuan. I think it's Cao Ren. I mean Cao Hong. Cao Hong, yeah. Anyway, I was saying something about the items before. It is two items you could get in this battle, but you basically have to wait. Because, I mean, it's just basically playing a waiting game. Uh, you need to make sure the Fallen Star event appears on both sides. How to do that? Well... They think they can pass our army? On Shu's side, you need to make sure you... Uh, Let's see here. Well, in this case, it would be you have to make sure that Zhao Yun and uh, Guan Yu both fall. Well, it's usually Zhang Fei. So yeah, Zhao Yun. I eat people like that for lunch. Yeah. So if you lose two of the three tigers, uh, the tiger general. Yeah. If you lose two. 
of the five Tiger Generals in this battle, and in default, it's usually three, the item will unlock. Uh, for Shu, I mean, I'm sorry, Wei, it's two generals. And I'm getting destroyed. Yeah, well, let me get up. Oh, no way. Really? Really? Now you've done it. That was a mistake, and I'm not dying through the crossbows. I can't die. Not yet. <sighs> okay, now it's time to kill those freaking crossbows because they've been alive for too long. I love for the fact that there's a bajillion officers, well not officers, troops over there and they just ignore the crossbows. And I forgot the silver sword. That would have been not good. I mean I could afford to miss them, but why would I miss them? So now we defeated both Zhao Ho Yuan and Cao Hong. Now we're going to go and defeat Sima Zhao before the catapults happen. And I'm going the wrong way. Let's go this way. Yeah, I forgot the names of the uh, two items you could get here. But yeah, like I said before, all you have to do is make sure two of your allies on each side fall specifically generals for way and two of the five uh, yeah two of the five tiger generals which is either Guan Yu, Zhang Fei, Zhao Yun uh, yeah, Guan Yu, Zhang Fei, Zhao Yun, Ma Chao and uh, Huang Zhang and usually see Zhao Yun and Zhang Fei, but in this case Guan Yu in the battle, so you just better hope those two fall. It's not easy to do, it's not, because you have to just sit there and wait. If you want to make it harder on yourself, play it on hard mode. Uh, anyway, we're gonna go now and... Ooh, they defeated similarly. That works. Now let's go up these stairs. So if you defeat Sun Li, Sao Xiu will appear. And all morale will shoot down through the well not through the roof, but you know. Alright, so we have to defeat Sima Zhao. So much for a silver shield. So now you defeat Sima Zhao and more reinforcements will come.
So we'll just wait. So they still have a bit left. It's really not much. All you have to really do is defeat the two officers or generals. So you defeat Dungai first if you want points for worthy opponents. I defeated an officer. Show them our strength. The next will defeat Mang Chong. Man Chong. We will crush them in one blow. I defeated an officer. Alright, that one's going first. I already know where off the bat that's a god captain. We must fight well. Alright, so wait, I just heard something. Oh there it is, okay. All right, so we defeated Man Chong. Now we're gonna go and uh, defeat Sao Xiu, because obviously those are the two reinforcements that appear for this battle. Sao Xiu after you defeat Sun Li, and then Man Chong after you defeat uh, Sima Zhao. And if you def reason why we had to defeat Sima Zhao is because of the catapults. Uh, if they successfully launch catap uh, the catapults, it will bombard and attack our main headquarters. And you have to defeat Sima Zhao before the cutscene of them firing the catapults. This happens twice. Once with Sima Zhao and the other time with Sao Ren. Unless you're playing on Wei's forces, then it'll be Zhang He. So now we're gonna go and defeat Sao Xiu. And I'm not gonna even worry about the officers in this time around. Cause they're probably two way up front and well. Hmm. This must be the wooden ox that my lord is using. That's the other reason. I was gonna try to avoid a cutscene, but well, that's not happening now. So yeah, the wooden ox cutscenes basically. Don't let anyone get ahead of you. If you break any of these wooden oxen, they will have some type of supplies. It could be a battle axe in here. It could be and uh, health. I forget what. I forget what's in every single one of them, but it's supplies basically that help you out. Really? 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 We must be triumphant. I thought I got everybody. Let's do that to get out of there. So now all well, I'm going well all we have to do now is defeat Simu Yi and Sao Sao, but uh I'm not gonna do that just yet.
what I'm going to do is go to where Liu Bei was standing at the beginning of the battle. And uh, around that area, there will be a Musa wine that I could get. Uh, yeah, where are the... Where is the ramp? There it is, alright. And in order to get this music to appear, you need to make sure you defeat every single general that's attacking all four sides, whether it's Guan Yu, Zhang Fei, depending on what you're playing, which mode. Uh, Ma Dai, Zhao Yun, and uh, Wei Yan, or Pong Tong in this case. So, once you defeat all the generals, then obviously Liu Bei will be mobilizing and moving up front as well. So once you go in here, I think you have to make a right. I'm sorry, next door. Make a right. And it should be in these two pots here. Yep. Alright, so now we're gonna go and defeat uh, Semi Yi first. And I think the quickest way is not going downwards to the right, but going upwards to the left. But uh, anyway, let's go off topic here. I'm I'm really shocked that I actually have done well at this case after this one 30 Musa modes, especially how repetitive this all is. I mean there's I mean that's partially the reason why sometimes I take my day off or whatever and not do it. But uh I mean playing the same game battle over and over again does seem type of kind well seem kind of, you know it does get kinda of boring every now and then, but you know, at the end of the day I said to myself, I'm going to do all 32 Musa modes for Dynasty Warriors 3. As for... I, I know a few people have asked in the past that, uh... If I was going to do Extreme Legends, the other forces, just for the fact the matter is... I really gave no one a, uh, a straight answer yet. I have made... well, I... I had a decision on whether doing it or not doing it a long time ago, but uh, yeah, let's leave that into suspense whether or not I'll be doing it. If I do do it, then yeah. If I don't do it, then the next thing we'll be doing is uh, fourth weapons. What's in the We're waiting. Come and let us compare strategies. You think that I'd respond to all of your taunts? I'm sorry, did I say fourth weapons? I meant, uh... Try to grab the last three items that I haven't collected yet first. Then I will be showing off what I'll, uh... What I'm going to say. Show off how to max out your items. Because I'm near max, it's just that I am not doing it the way I, I was supposed to be doing it. Um, and last but not least, uh, well, me off camera, max them all out. But after that, we'll be doing fourth weapons. That is if I decide to pass on seven, uh, you should realize your stupidity. The seven Musa modes. But, uh, if I do decide to do seven Musa modes, then not only prepare for, uh, the seven Musa modes and everything I told you, but also prepare for fifth weapons as well, because, well, yeah. Because I'm not going to do the seven Musa modes and then not do the fifth weapons. Uh-uh. Anyway, we're at Simi now.
have done all that I could. You know, I'm just going to go by foot on this one. And here's the tyrant music. I shall destroy all who get in my way. All right, let's try to weak south out a bit. I don't think I did that much, but the reason why I'm running away at the moment is because, well, I need to grab that dim sum first. Then I'll continue on. The dim sum, the dim sum, not dim sum. Then dim sum, that should be over here. Or here. There we go, over here. And let's secure these gates, that way no more troops could come out of it. I see Sao Sao's on the move. Whoops. Didn't mean to do that. This is not happening right now. Oh, well, he just got hurt. Okay, why am I getting stunned and why is he getting health back? Is that a joke? Alright, there we go. He's almost there, and that sergeant can't do anything about it. It cannot end here. Not yet. And that's a win. Okay, I don't know why, but why every time I kill a commander, a particularly way, something pops out of them. Meanwhile, they really shouldn't be. Alright, so 22 minutes. Well, that's... Uh, it could be a bit... It could have been worse. Alright, now we get our third weapon. Okay. Now the items... Bleh, nothing. Like I said, I have completed this level. Well, not this level. I've been farming on hard mode, so there's a reason why I don't... A plus 20 means nothing. Well, I think I had something better than that before I got that plus 39. So, our KO counts 298, which isn't half bad for the fact the matter is we gain... We got ha that many points plus half. Uh, we lost 800 points because we lost every single one of our bodyguards. So we got a good 4,000 points, and watch. With my luck, the defense is going to go up after this battle. It went up a bit. So technically, yes, it went up. Great. Yeah, I told you.
with my luck, it was going to go up after this battle. Anyway, we'll save. And here's the ending for Jiang Wei. And that's the Musa mode for Jiang Wei, let alone every single Shu character.
All right, so we have completed 30 of the 32 Musa modes for Dynasty Warriors 3. And yes, I'm still being a bit lazy, but I'm getting there. I mean, you know what? I'm going to strike a wild deal right now. If I fail, you know what? I'm not going to even do that. That's so messed up. I was going to say, if I fail to max all these characters out, with the exception of Zhushu and Lu Meng, I'll, I'll do the uh, Dynasty Warriors uh, 3 Extreme Legends stuff. But, uh, no, I'll... Uh, yeah, but uh, anyway, we'll figure out something with these, because, well, I'm still being a lazy bastard, so... Yeah. Anyway, we have completed 30 of the 32 Musa modes, and, uh... Yeah. And the only two Musa modes we have left are, uh... Zushu... And Lu Meng. But, uh, the next Musa mode, obviously, we're gonna be doing, because we'd be... We had a pattern for a while now. Shu, Wei, and Wu. So the next Musumo we'll be doing is Jushu. Shuju, I should say. Yep. So next Musumo we'll be doing is Shuju. And that will be the end for all the way characters. Anyway, you've been watching my gaming adventures and I'll see you for the next part, which will be the first part for Shushu. And now after all that stuff I said with it, I may have to do Extreme Legends just because well, the con I just feel like being a, a, I just felt like, well, I'm not saying I felt like, but yeah, I feel like a complete bastard now. Anyway, yeah, so anyway, next part, Musa mode for Shushu, part one, peace.